welcome back. I am so pumped. I am here with Mama Cakes who is filming today and uh, my stepdad Carlos. We are on our way to Ocala National Forest where we will be going to Silver Glen Springs today. Um, I don't know if most of you know anything about all the springs in Florida, but there are 700 different spr springs in the state of Florida, which is unbelievable. Uh, so the spring we're going to today, again, is Silver Glen and it actually flows into Lake George, which is the second largest lake in Florida after Lake Okeechobee. So super amazing. Um, if you have never been, I definitely encourage anybody that's visiting Florida to visit any one of these beautiful springs. The water is aquamarine. You can find a bunch of wildlife, uh, a bunch of different uh, fish species, species that we'll hopefully be able to see today. Manatees, gators, you name it. It's going to be great. So I thought I'd just take you guys along to show you what this spring is all about. Um, it is uh, 4th of July weekend, so we're expecting a lot of people to be there. Um, it is like 9 a.m., so hopefully we have, I think we have like an hour and a half drive to get there. Hopefully we won't have to wait too long of a line. We're going to go eat breakfast, and then we're going to head out. So get going. there's like five or six cars in front of us so we did good and we made good time um, I think it's because it's Friday and not Saturday or Sunday I think tomorrow this weekend is gonna be just insane because people are off work five cars later and we are headed in so oh, look, look, look. It's cool. it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> so this parking lot is actually a lot smaller than all the other um, all the other springs uh, we were just informed that it only holds 100 uh, cars so that's why we had to wait in line. So I guess we came at a good time because he said that at 7 a.m. there was already like a line, a huge line to get in. So I think getting here a little later gave us a little time, you know, for people to leave. Ooh. All right, we finally arrived y'all and it is packed. Okay, I'm gonna try to get as close as I can. This is close.
Dominican, you guys. I have never. I have never experienced fishing. I mean, fishing. Being able to be this close to these freaking fish. Some of them are huge. Look, they're right under us. They're not even scared. For those of you who probably think of me in Hedwig, I hope that you're not fishing. It is a national park, so you're not allowed to fish in this area. There is a designated fishing area that you can fish, but I'm sure they're not going to be as plentiful. <laughs> of the oh cave God, down there. So to see if I could oh. take y'all down there so you could see it. <laughs> that the volume on my GoPro, I guess, was messed up with, the, I think, the pressure when I went down and tried to go into that cave. Um, so, I'm just gonna talk over myself even though I have no idea what I was saying. Probably something about how freezing the water is. Fun fact, uh, it maintains a temperature of 72 degrees Fahrenheit um, at this spring year around, which is freaking cold, especially when it is overcast out but look how beautiful this water is, y'all. Oh my goodness. Oh, I am pretty sure this is the part where it started thundering and lightning super bad on us. Um, this is actually the first spring that I've been to that had two lifeguards on duty. I don't know if you guys can see him back there, but they actually did make everybody um, get out of the spring. So we actually got like, I think two hours of swimming and filming, which was unbelievable. No complaints here whatsoever. All right.
Hi guys, so sorry again for the volume. I, I seriously have no idea what happened. I think maybe like water got in it or I have no idea honestly. I mean, it's supposed to be waterproof with the GoPro, but um, it, all I'm getting is like a buzz, buzzing noise um, on the actual video, no volume of me talking. But anyway, I'm guessing I was telling you guys how amazing the, the spring was. I really do hope that you guys see this video and it inspires um, you guys to take a trip to one of the many springs that we have here in Florida. It was like $5 per person to get in, which is definitely worth it. You can make it a day trip. It is super, super fun. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you like this video, make sure to comment, like, subscribe, and I will see y'all next time.